a lot of the organizations raise money for to research into adult cancers, but not a lot of money goes into funding childhood cancers to research into that. So that's what we're doing. So what can people come here and do? People can come out here and they can support us by just coming and watching, or they can come and donate. We have some raffle baskets. They can um, get sponsors to pay money to see them get their heads shaved, and so that's kind of the big part of it. We're involved to beat cancer, so sponsorship and getting people to shave their heads is <laughs> cancer he had on his back right near his spine and he battled this for I guess about a year went through chemotherapy and uh, radiation at the Hemby Children's Center here in Charlotte they did a great job and he's a real trooper I'll tell you what he can stand more pain than I can more <laughs> needles he is a real trooper and we're real proud of him and uh, he is five years clear of cancer now I think everything is good And I'm going to shave my head for him. That's awesome. <laughs> I'm gonna get three girls. Don't 
much, much more, so feel free to write him a check, <laughs> make a donation, go online. Uh, you can find his specific page under our St. Baldrick's team and donate to him specifically to help raise his total. That would be awesome. You were so cute in all your graduation. Wait, I changed my mind. And we're done. That's awesome. Great. Right, Chicks dig it. Just look. Exactly. They're paying top dollar for this in New York. Seriously. I'm doing it for clear to spot. Yeah, for their spot. Oh my god. <laughs> you have a huge wall. Isn't it? I mean, <laughs> I've had many head injuries at the end. That purple spot? Is that me? That's probably a good doctor. Of course. You're so mean. 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 You're so Honey, I need a motorcycle again. <laughs> See, I knew I should have sold it. Uh, I'm good. I'm over here sweating. Oh, over here sweating. Did you pull off? I did. Congrats on your first one graduating. I didn't choose to I would totally let you drive the motorcycle. But well, you got to go through motorcycle safety training. That was, that was really, really, really big. Time. I think everybody should. <laughs>